I'm Christopher Walken, and I play video games. I got a fever, and the only prescription is mushrooms. All right, kitties, maybe it's time for a blast from the past. How about Super Mario Brothers? Certainly, you remember this one, the game that started a revolution. There I am, bonk, bonk, and look, Shroomy Tunes. Now, I know some of you might be thinking, Christopher Walken, this isn't the Super Mario Brothers I remember. That's right, this is a revamped version of it. Everything's better when it's been revamped. Look at Nicolas Cage. That's not his hair. This game has better video quality than the original version, and I don't like it. I like my nostalgia to be grainy and pixelated. Let's move on to something else. Super Mario World. This is how a walking through should be. Fast-paced me screaming at you while I play the game. Now I'm Mario, but I'm snotting fireballs. Yeah, they come out of his nose. Now I'm gonna need a little friend. Yoshi! Hooray, says my... What is he, an alligator? I don't... Some kind of two-legged lizard. He's got a problem eating. Eats too much, too fast. Mario's got a brother named Luigi, in case you've been hiding under a rock for the last 28 years. And Luigi, he doesn't have much of a role in this. Only if you play a two, and let's face it, nobody wants to be play a two. Play a one, that's where it's at. Finally, we've made it to Iggy's castle. The builders of Iggy's castle, they were crazy. They had a deal, a sweetheart deal with a man who sold chain link fencing. And that guy made millions. Now see, why would you have a giant stamping foot made of rock in your house? Seems like a bad idea. Come home, drunk, two in the morning, stumbling. Forget, you forget that there's a giant concrete pillar ready to crush you. Oh, look, there's Iggy. Don't even ask how Iggy got to the middle of a floating, tilty platform in the middle of molten lava. Again, seems like bad engineering to put that in your house. Now we get to travel to Donut Land. Isn't this exhilarating? Mario was invented back in 1981 by a Japanese gentleman named Yoshihiro Akiyama. Rumor has it that he was in his bathroom when a pipe suddenly burst and not knowing how to fix it himself, he called the only person who could help, a plumber, an Italian named Mario. Mario uh, came through the pipes to fix the pipe and this Japanese man thought it was such a novel way to fix a pipe he murdered Mario with a wrench and took his identity and turned it into a video game franchise. I'm gonna show you how to get a star so that you can blast all the baddies with your star powers like Mark Wahlberg how many times did you sit up at night in your room playing this game when you was a kid? And then your mom would come in, Please, your father's so sick. And you'd say, Mom, I got the star. I'm invincible. Make me a sandwich. All of this stuff here. It's like they hired it out to the lowest bidder. And they didn't do measurements and nothing. You gotta jump from one thing to the next. Again, let me point out. How horrible it would be to live in this place, especially if you like to drink. Oh, that poor turtle up top there. He's been trapped there for so long, he's starved to death. Looks like Karen Carpenter. That's an old reference, you should wiki that. Those things, they're immune to my fiery fireballs. They're coming, coming back to life. Zombie turtles. You need to hit him in the head. That's how you kill a zombie. Unless it's Rob Zombie. I don't know how you kill Rob Zombie. On second thought, let's just skip all over this boring shit and go right to the main castle. All right, kitties, here we are. It's the main boss. This is King Koopa, and he's a bastard. I'm gonna show you how to beat him. Here we go. Grab his little fella, throw it up in the air, and then bonk him. 
sometimes you miss. That's life. Oh, it's the princess. She's trapped inside the floaty clowny duck face thing. Bowser's sitting on the princess right now. It's uncomfortable. Maybe the princess is building these little mechanical men. Bonk. There you go, kitties. The princess falls to her death. Both legs shattered, bones sticking out like Joe Theismann. Now it's time for our giant Yoshi gang bang. This is gonna get ugly. You better leave. There's Luigi. Finally, he shows up. He's like a blister. He only arrives when all the hard work's done. What a prick. Well, that's it for me. I hope you enjoyed this Christopher walking through. If you got a suggestion for a game you want me to give you a walking through on, leave it in the comments. And make sure you like our Facebook page, Game Society Films. Bye, kitties.